Hi guys, in this tutorial we're going to talk about how to find a loop or a cycle in a sync linked list. So, let's discuss about the cycle first. So, what cycle is basically a cycle occurs when a node's next points back to the previous node in a list means you can see right here so the node next this is the last node of sync linked list and the next of this last node is pointing back to the uh, previous node it can be point any any node right it can be point to this node this node right now it's pointing to the 40 right so instead of pointing to null it's pointing to the node itself so it is creating a cycle right and uh, we need to write java program to uh, to find whether the cycle exists in a singly linked list or not so let's get started in the back end code for that, I have already created one class with name loop reduction. So inside this class, we're going to use of Floyd algorithm to find whether a loop is exist inside sync linked list or not. So let's get started now. Private Boolean method name will be is loop exist without any input parameter. And we're going to create a head of node type which will always point to the first node of singly linked list. Now we're going to check whether uh, head is pointing to null or not. If it is non-null, then we're going to perform further operation on this list. Now, as per the Floyd algorithm, we are going to use two pointer. The first pointer will be slow pointer and another pointer will be fast pointer. Both will be uh, node type one will be slow pointer another one will be fast pointer so slow and fast initially both will be pointing to the first node of singly linked list means both will be pointing to the head now we're gonna use while loop so exist exit condition of while loop will be fast should not be null or let's use object object start non null fast and object start non null fast dot get next means fast is not null and fast reference should should also not be null then only we gonna perform uh, we'll be moving our pointer one step or two step forward okay now uh, the next step is let's create some dummy data node 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 right we are discussed till 80 right now after 80 also it's keep going 40 50 60 70 80 then again 40 50 because it's creating a cycle right so these uh, 2 to 4 and 5 list will be keep continuing right so after 80 also it start pointing to 40 then 50 40 50 and 60 70 80 right we again reach here right now again 80 is pointing to 40 right 40 50 and likewise it's keep going on right so we have created two pointer one is slow and another one is fast so let's create this pointer one is slow another one is fast initially both pointer will be pointing to the wherever head is pointing so head is pointing to first node of singly linked list so this pointer will also point first node of singly linked list now let's write while condition i mean statement of while loop it will be uh, so on each iteration we're gonna move slow pointer one step forward slow dot get next and fast pointer two step forward fast dot get next dot get next right 
<coughs> so right now we are at this pointer right again what we're gonna check here so once both pointer right both pointer reach to the same position in that case we're gonna uh, return true right means I'll explain you what I'm saying here right so what I'm saying is uh, if slow is equal to equal to fast then we're gonna return not return let's create one another variable uh, boolean is loop exist boolean dot false initially we're gonna pass false right if it is exist we're gonna reassign value to this variable as true okay and we're gonna return the same to the color method not here return is loop exist all right now let's discuss right what we have done here so right now these both pointer right slow and fast pointer is pointing to the first node of this list now uh, we're gonna check whether fast is null or not so fast means initially fast value we have had right so fast is pointing to the first node and fast next that is 20 right so it's it is not null so both condition is true right this both condition is true it will come inside this uh, while loop and it will execute these statements so what this first statement is slow is equal to slow dot get next means uh, using this statement we're gonna move one step forward this statement is saying you have to uh, start pointing to the uh, slow dot get next slow is this and then next of slow is 20 so it will start pointing to 20 and now the second statement is fast is equal to fast dot get next dot get next means it will move two step forward so first step is at 20 and second step at 30 right now we're gonna check whether slow and fast is pointing to the same reference same address or not it's not pointing again if it will continue for the next iteration it will check whether fast is null or not so fast is at point uh, at node 30 right and fast dot next is at pointer at node 40 so it's not uh, null both condition is true it will come inside this loop this while loop and it will move slow pointer one step forward so let's move it now it start pointing to 30 and uh, fast pointer will move two step forward so it will start pointing to 50 right so one step is at 40 and second step is at 50 okay now again we're gonna check whether uh, slow and fast is pointing to the same address no it's not right because slow is at 30 and fast is at 50 all right now again we're gonna move um, I mean we're gonna check whether this while condition is true or not so fast is pointing to 50 and slow fast dot get next means uh, fast reference is pointing to 60 it's not null both condition again true it will move slow pointer one step forward right and it will start pointing to node 40 now using this condition we're gonna move fast two step forward it start pointing to 70 now again this it will evaluate this condition whether it's true or not so both slow and fast is fast pointer is pointing to different node it's not pointing to same node so again this condition is false it will not come inside if block again it will uh, for, it will go for next iteration so it will check whether um, fast is null or not so fast is at 70 and fast dot get next is at 80 so it's not null it will come inside this again while loop and it will move slow pointer one step forward and using this line of code it will move fast pointer two step forward one step is at 80 and another step is at uh, 40 right again we're gonna check whether slow and fast is pointing to the same node no it's not so this condition is false it will go for the next iteration and it will check whether fast is um, null or not 
So fast is pointing to 40 and fast next is also not null, right? It's pointing to 50. So both condition is true. It will come inside this while loop and it will execute this first line of code. So using this first line of code, we're going to move our this pointer one step forward, right? And now when it comes to the second line, so using this line of code, it will move uh, this fast pointer two step forward. It's a one step, it's a two step, right? Now you can see these both pointer, right? You, uh, is pointing to 60 node. So we're gonna check whether slow and fast is pointing to the same node or not. So slow is pointing to 60 and fast is also pointing to the 60, means same node. It reached some, somewhere here, 60. Slow and fast is reached to the same node here, right? So now at that point, this condition is true. If condition is true and it will come inside this if block and it will uh, reassign the value uh, of to this variable as true, right? Now, uh, again, we forgot to break this loop here. If we found this value, we're gonna break this uh, this loop here itself because we are not we don't want to iterate after finding the loop we don't want to iterate this again and again so we're gonna break this right so right now uh, slow pointer is pointing to 60 and fast pointer is also pointing to 60 and we're gonna break this loop here itself so that it will not continue for the further iteration right because it will keep going on there is a cycle so we have to forcefully break this loop otherwise it will keep printing keep going on until stack is not overflow so now we found the loop here and we have break the uh, loop here itself and we are returning the true value to the caller method right so this is what we have done till now now let's write main method to test this logic <coughs> so let's create um, object of current class test is equal to new loop detection <coughs> Now let's create uh, nodes. First is equal to new node. As we discussed, we're gonna use uh, we're gonna use uh, eight nodes, right? As we discuss here, and then last node will start pointing to forty node. So let's do that. Two, three, four, five, six seven and eight all right second third fourth fifth seven first second third fourth fifth sixth seven Eight, right let's change this data value it's 80 right now let's uh, connect them together so list dot head is equal to first all right now first dot set next start pointing to second second dot set next start pointing to third and third third dot set next start pointing to fourth so fourth fourth dot next start pointing to fifth and fifth if the reference start pointing to sixth and sixth reference point to seventh seventh reference will start pointing to eighth right and there is no any uh, further node right 
so eight reference will start pointing to null so let's test this first print linker list dot display list dot head right so let's print this list and verify whether we have uh, nodes created successfully or not 1 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 right there is no any cycle till now right so what I'm gonna do here I'm gonna create cycle some setting 8 dot set next to uh, 8 dot set next to 40 fourth right now we have cycle right so I'm gonna command this and just gonna call uh, is loop exist method so list dot is loop exist let's pass one message here Let's run this. So it's returning true, right? So loop is exist. Let's remove this and we're gonna check whether it is returning false or not because this, this is the line which is uh, connecting uh, last node, right? This last node to this node. Now we have deleted this reference which is making a um, loop. Now eight references pointing to null so there is no any loop uh, exist it should return false it is returning false right so this is working fine guys we have done with this video guys and thank you so much for watching this video thank you